Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing another grocery haul. Um, this week I tried to spend a little bit less than I usually do. Um, I did have someone comment on my last um, grocery haul where I spent $240. Um, they just mentioned that they wish they had $240 to spend on groceries, which I do realize um, in other countries that might be a lot. I guess even in Australia that can be a lot, but $240, as you can see, doesn't get a great deal. But I do get extra things to go into the next week, so I'm not sure. But um, yeah, I'm going to show you what I got. I did only spend, I think it was uh, 218 so I tried to spend a little bit less and tried not to get extra things. Um, however, there were a few things that I did get that were on special, so... Let's get into it. Um, I might quickly show you what my meal plan is like and then um, I'll show you what I got. Okay guys, so here, here is my little meal plan menu for the week. So it's very hard to read. I actually did get a new whiteboard marker. So next, next week it'll be a lot easier to read. So Thursday, so today is Thursday. We've got a roller disco on. Uh, Friday I've got curried sausages down which I actually have in the fridge that we need to use. Christmas party on Saturday that we're going to so we don't need food. Um, I do have a silver side that I bought last week that I'm going to use. Um, schnitzel which I bought last week as well. Um, beef stroganoff which I have all the ingredients for in the freezer and fridge. And then I do have another sausage and mash for Wednesday. Okay guys, so like I said, I tried to spend a little bit less this week. So here is my subtotal it was $204, there we go. So I tried to stay around $200, which I thought I did pretty well at. So um, where we got? Oh, here we go, 205 was my invoice. So this is what, $205 get so I can tell the difference is a little bit less so $30 less worth of food but um, yes let's get through and have a look at it so um, same again this week I did get another barbecue chicken that wasn't included in that 205 just because I couldn't really find it when I was looking for it so got that so I'll do some chicken salad uh, with that, I've got celery and stuff in the fridge, so that's going to be yummy. I have some stuff here. So this is from the deli section, so I got some Twiggy Sticks for the boys for lunch. I also got some of this um, chicken slices, so it's just like sliced deli chicken. Um, I thought I'd get that for the hubby for his lunches. Uh, he might like that one, so just something a little bit different. I got um, half a kilo of ham, so the youngest has that on his ham cheese toasties in the morning and we use that during the week for lunch meat. I did get, so these are a couple of things that I didn't really have to buy but I bought just to have them in the freezer. So I got some lean beef mints, so we have a lot of taco stuff in the fridge so I thought just in case we need to have a backup meal. Here is a backup meal. So I got taco uh, beef mints for tacos. Or we could have spaghetti or anything like that. So I like having a backup just in case we don't feel like what I've planned for. I also got some of the um, the fattier beef mints. So this is for me. I thought just in case I make something up I might make up some meatballs or something this weekend. So um, I just got that as well. Over here I got some hash browns, so last couple of weeks we've been having um, a cook up for breakfast on Sunday morning so I thought I'd grab these hash browns and just keep them in the freezer so that if we decide to have a cook up we have these in the freezer. Also grab some cauliflower rice, so I like to have these just on hand to add to some, any of my keto meals. Um, it's just something as a different option rather than um, having the broccoli or the cauliflower so I thought I just had that. 
got the uh, got some ice cream so we're out, out, out of ice cream for the boys so I wanted to get some of that which I am actually going to stop and put in the um, freezer because I can tell it's melting because it is boiling hot here in Townsville okay so back into the cold stuff again I got some cheese slices as usual we we're out this week so need to get them got this Mercy Valley cheddar cheese so it's like a sharp cheddar I like to have that with my potato bake, uh, not potato, cauliflower bake. Also just as like a snack, so I'll have that with some twiggy sticks or ham or something. Good keto snack. Um, I've got some yogurt pouches. I only needed four this week because it's the one that he'd, um, Quentin didn't eat one from this week. So I only got four, so I only got what I needed. Got some Greek feta. So I have been craving Greek salad, but like the Greek salad that is just like a cucumber salad. So I got some cucumbers and a red onion and we have heaps of cherry tomatoes from our um, tomato bush. So yeah, really enjoying that and crave, I really want some now. It's just so nice and fresh and cold and yummy. So yeah, I got that. I got this um, cream cheese because I was actually thinking of making a concoction um, using cream cheese and I have some pesto so I thought I'd put mix that and pesto with um, with sausages somehow and do like a bit of a sausage pesto concoction I'll see how that goes I might film it I don't know but yeah that's what I got that for Got my cream, which I use for my coffee and other drinks. Got some sour cream, so I got the fat one and the light one. So we have these, I have these in scrambled eggs, tacos, cauliflower bake, lots of options with that. And the boys have it on their tacos. I've got our usual three liter milk. Um, so that's like 2%. Up the front here we're going to do our produce, so I've got some raspberries and blueberries. I like to eat them as a snack, so i got some of those. They're starting to actually taste okay now, though I kind of just started back in season and they're actually not too bad. Um, like I said, I've got the red onion and the cucumber, so this is one of those oriental cucumbers, I think. Continental. Continental cucumbers. So, um, yeah, i got those for Greek salad. Got a bag of mushrooms for the beef stroganoff. I have all the other ingredients, but I did need mushrooms. Up the back here, I've got three loaves of this Wonder White smooth whole grain bread. That's what the boys like to have, so that's what we get. Um, I grabbed, <laughs> I got two bananas. I'm not sure where I only got two. Um, we do have a few, but I think by next week they're probably going to be yucky. Um, but in our climate they don't really last very long because it is quite hot and humid so they don't last too long. I've got some shortcut bacon so this is a shortcut bacon it's just this bit this meaty bit um, for those over in America who are not sure what I'm saying when I say shortcut this is it it's this little bit of meat from the bacon so yeah that was um, that was on special so I grabbed that I think it was like half price so school I've got some a head of cauliflower here, so I thought, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that sausage concoction I'm going to make, but I thought maybe I could have it with a cauliflower mash, so I got that, plus I use it for other things as well. I've got some apples here, so we're out of apples, so I needed to get some apples for the boys for their lunches. Shallots I got to have with the cauliflower when I make my cauliflower bake. Um, I like having shallots. I might even put it in other meals as well. Let's see how we go. Got some pancakes. So for our Sunday brunt, uh, lunch uh, breakfast. So, sorry, I'll say that again. For our Sunday breakfast, um, I thought maybe we might have pancakes. So I got some of that. These were on special. So these are the big two liter bottles of tomato sauce and barbecue sauce. And I thought, hey, they're on special. Just grab them. It's coming up to Christmas, I'm sure we're going to be using a lot of sauce. 
Um, here I got some pasta packets. So these are like the um, pasta and sauce packets. So I got a bacon and carb bacon carbonara and the Alfredo. So we put these with different meals, like with silver side or just on the side of as a side. So yeah, that's just a quick thing to make up. Takes like 12 minutes in the microwave. I got some more bolognese sauce, just um, some pasta sauce, just to have in the fridge, in the cupboard, just in case we make spaghetti. I got these um, pro plus protein, low carb protein packed shakes, They're the iced coffee ones, which are really good, good macros for me. Um, so yeah, something because it's getting so hot, it's good to have like a colder drink in case I'm not feeling a hot coffee so I got a couple of those and they're on special I usually only buy them when they're on special because they're about five dollars each usually so yeah what else we've got okay so we've got a couple I got a couple of um, cracker rice crackers um, just got them for the hubby to try and have them sometimes he takes them for lunch sometimes just as a snack while we're watching movies and stuff so got those there got a couple of tins of sandwich tuna so um, it's just tuna kind of in a spreadable form so yeah I'd like to use them in in different things so I got a couple of them I got some apple and orange juice so I also got poppers so the poppers are for when we go out places so the boys can grab a popper and just take that with them or if we're in the house then they can have just juice it's just easier to transport the poppers than it is a big bottle of juice. Um, up the back here I've got some dry cat food so um, yeah we, ha we have two cats and yeah this is what they have. I also got some more dog food so I'm not sure if you know but we did have a dog that passed away but we've got a new puppy dog and she is fitting in really well with Jax so yeah got more dog tin food. Um, I got this uh, deodorant for the hubby and the boys to use. It's on special and everyone needs deodorant, right? So I grabbed that. And also some bath wash for the boys. Um, they're almost out so I just wanted to get some more. And last but not least was the, um, the uh, whiteboard markers so that I can see my meal plan a lot better. Okay guys, so that is my grocery haul for this week. Um, tried to spend a little bit less, tried to keep to a $200 budget and I did pretty well. So yeah. Okay guys, so that's it for this week. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button down below or I'll have like a little picture of my face on the screen here somewhere that you can just click. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and have a Merry Christmas. And I'll see you in the comments. Bye.